Hey, all my children. It's Daddy Abdullah here. I love you all so much. Is it important how we look on the outside? Should we dress up in nice cowboy hats and fancy, fancy clothes? And will that make us proper on the inside? No. Now, it's nice to see what the outside of us looks like. But keep in mind, there's an outside and an inside. There's an outside of us and there's an inside of us. And I enjoy the outside package of a lot of you. I really do. But you know, a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful package, a gorgeous, absolutely fabulous package, like so many of you live inside of, can be a terrible, terrible curse. Yeah, what am I talking about? If you rely on the outside package, you dress it up and you strut it around, you're all that. We have an expression, <laughs> expression in the US, all that in a bag of chips, all that in a bag of chips. Now that's gone now. I still say it because I'm a couple years behind, but when we walk around and think we're all that in a bag of chips, yo, we're really not. We're just strutting the outside of us. And you really don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. Man looks on the outward appearance. God looks on the heart. So, you know, when we're walking down the street, we look at each other and we go, oh, look, look at that person, look at that person. I got eyes, I can see. They're not very good eyes sometimes. That's why I wear a sunglass because I look too much into the computer. But I got eyes, I can see. When I see a beautiful package, and it has to be a female, sorry, fellas. When I see a beautiful package, I go, whoa, wow. And that's okay. That's attraction. That's God created this attraction between the sexes. You know, isn't it interesting we've only got two sexes? What if we had male, female, and then schmorkel? Male, female, and schmorkel. How complicated would that be? But no, it's not that way. <laughs> it's pretty simple. Male and female. Now, these days, a lot of people are confused. Am I all male and part female? I'm not going to fuss with, about that. Uh, too many religious people fuss about that. I'm not going to go there. I'll leave that for others. But I will say this. It's really wonderful. Wonderful. I celebrate the fact that there are two sexes. And I know which one I am. I'm the male sex. And so many of you gorgeous, beautiful young ladies are the female sex. Thank you, God. And I enjoy the outside package. I'm not going to lie. And, and when uh, we put you guys up on the playlist, I don't expect you to all get up and preach a sermon like I do. If you want to sing a song and wiggle around a little bit, hey, that's expression. That's expression. And I want you to be able to express yourself. I really do. So let's celebrate the outside package, but accept the fact that inside of us, that's where we really live. Man looks on the outward appearance. God looks on the heart. Inside of us is what really matters, you guys. The inside of you. The inside of you. You think I look good? You ought to see how pretty I am on the inside. Why? I've been working on me for a lot of years. I've been working on me, so I'm pretty advanced on the inside. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus, for setting an example to me. <laughs> so we want to pursue the outside package. It's fine. God gave us the tension between the sexes for a reason for mating purposes, for procreational purposes, having babies, for getting together and pairing off purposes. God created it that way. 
It's that way in the whole animal kingdom too, between the horses and cows and chickens, the beetles. Everything is mating. Everybody is mating, and that's okay. That's okay. I'm glad. Aren't you glad? Aren't you glad? Isn't that wonderful? I love it. I love, even at this age, I love beautiful people. I love a beautiful young man. I think, wow, I, I wish I looked that good. A guy with long hair, I'll go, hmm. I want to trade hair. You want to trade hair, dude? And they, they usually run away real fast, like big, long dreadlocks. And I say, yeah, where are you going? Where are you going? Wait a minute. Let's trade. And they go, ah, hmm. Wow, he's weird. But no, I appreciate the outward package. I appreciate the package that we're in. But the really the really the really thing I want to do is develop inside of here, inside of here, inside of this. I want to develop my mind, I want to develop my body, I want to develop my social relationships, I want to develop my spiritual relationships. I want to be a full, complete, balanced, whole person. I don't want to be a partial person, an imbalanced person with a really good mind, a really good body, a really good social, but no God in there. That's not. A really good physical, a really good social, a really good God, but you're stupid in the head sometimes. You got to have it all. You got to have the balance. The point is that we are human beings. We're human beings. Aren't you grateful? Aren't you grateful, kids, that we are not all aliens? 7.8 billion of us, all ETs the same. Aren't you grateful for that? Isn't that wonderful? I love that. I love that about the human race. I love people watching. I love going down in places where there's lots of people and just people watch. I love all kind of people. I love all colors of people. I love all sizes of people. I love people. Now, are people all good? No, it's not the point. But I'm going to love people because the commandment is love God with all your heart and your neighbor and everybody's our neighbor is yourself. So I'm going to practice loving people even when I don't love people. Sometimes I make a joke. I say, I love my dogs more than I do my next door neighbor. I got to work on that. My next door neighbor is important. I guess I just don't love them as much as I do my dogs. I got to work on that. We're imperfect. The preacher says, you've sinned. You're sinners. You're evil sinners. Of course we're sinners. The word sin means it's an archery term. It means shoot the bow and arrow, hit the bullet the bullseye and miss it's not a perfect shot you're always off a little bit you're imperfect that's what sin is imperfection none of us are perfect look, as good as i look and yeah i do look pretty good i'm not perfect i'm arrogant well yeah i just bragged about my how, how good i looked i don't think i look that good but i guess for 68 i look pretty good thanks girls <laughs> keeping <laughs> keeping me young that's what that is. I love you guys. It's all about love, and it's all about developing the inside of us and the outside of us. Do that. Do that in your life, okay? Daddy Abdullah, loving you guys to pieces. I love you so much. I don't love you to death. I'm going to love you to life. Love me back, babies. Love me back. Come on, get me. Love me back. I love you so much.